Hello, this is Blackbird the Nerd. And this is Dismal. And you're probably wondering why we're back at the Create a New World thing. Well, my friend Des Broadham recently told me about an inter interesting little challenge. You guys probably already heard of it, but here it goes. 404. What shall we call it? No, I'm fresh out of ideas. You can just call it anything. What do you think of that name? Well, technically you're only going to die once, then you'll return to the other world and the challenge will be over. Wait, really? Yeah, you can't leave the cave. Okay, it's not going to be really as much of a challenge as it is me... Well... <sighs> well, I guess while you're playing, I'll explain to them what the 404 challenge is, for those who don't know. Basically, someone discovered that the 404 seed map has a uh, patch of gravel that, when hit, uh, basically releases the gravel and creates a giant pitfall into a giant cavern system below. Now, because of this awesome cavern system that was discovered, someone decided that there should be a challenge involved where you have exactly one day until nightfall to collect as much resources as you can from the overworld. Then, as nightfall approaches, you destroy a patch of gravel, um, causing yourself to fall into the dungeon below. From that point on, you can no longer return to the uh, above ground world. You have to survive while in the dungeon below. You also have to play this map on at least a difficulty of medium. Okay, so I'm going to be doing that, except I will be going back into the cavern after I die. I call it a continuous challenge. Hmm, doesn't make much sense to me, but whatever. Let's just say that this is a let's play and I'm trying to keep the ball rolling. Because hmm. really, that is the only thing. Oh, and as you can probably tell, I'm using the Animal Craft mod. And many of you may know that I am a kind of an Animal Crossing fan. Wouldn't you say that? I guess you could say you're an Animal Crossing fan. Yep. I mean, I usually end up screwing myself by just uh, manipulating time too much. And then, whoa! <laughs> what have we here? No, no, don't get sidetracked, Ken. Don't get sidetracked. And now I'm going to have to hunt down the pig in a little bit. Yep, we're already wasting time. Eh, but what else, but what else are my videos meant to do? As you can see, we uh, seem to be carving through much of the dirt with cactus. Yep. And my hand has... And my hand has splinters like hell. Wool needles, actually. Well, they're splinter. You can still call them splinters, though, because they're inside my hands and all. Wow, three minutes already. Oh god, I, I am. I somehow screwed. feel like the biggest challenge of this 4 4 challenge is going to be finding our way back. Hmm. Nope. I can see it all the way over there. Okay. That's now. Wait till you get farther away. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Oh yeah, and in the previous video, I promised to put a link in the description to Desperatum's channel, but I can't, you know, edit the description. I don't know why. It keeps saying bad value. Say what you're gonna say, Dismal. No, I have nothing to say. Really? Nope, couldn't think of anything. Oh. Well, good. Good old water. Mmm, got that crunch. Gotta get that crunch, yeah. Uh. You see, that's what I love about the internet. You do it. You do and say as many embarrassing things as you want, and it'll never have negative repercussions in your actual life later on. That's completely untrue. Always gotta ruin the jokes. Oh, that was a joke. Yes.
Getting bored yet? Not really. So, uh, what kind of resources are you trying to gather besides wood? Like, what are you planning to do once you finally get down to the uh, cavern system? Mine. What else would you do? Well, you realize there are going to be enemies down there, right? Oh yeah, I gotta hunt down some sheep, don't I? Why do you need to hunt down sheep? Wool for a bed. You realize it's gonna be dark all the time here, unless you do. Well, you can't set torches in the It's not part of the rules. But, uh. Well. Minus your light sources like lava, there's always gonna be enemies spawning. So if you were to just, uh, make a bed, you would, uh. It would ultimately just cause you to run into creeps. That is why I'm going to encase the bed in dirt, save for a door. Hmm. Well, I mean, creeps are still going to spawn even when it's daytime underground. That's part of the 404 challenge. I mean, daytime doesn't really matter anymore. No, but it's still a good way to, you know, regain health. Beds regain health now? I thought they did. I mean, they no, did they before. Never have. They, beds don't regain health? No. I'm sure they never well, what the hell am I collecting, you know, this wool That's what I was thinking. I'm also wondering why you haven't made an axe yet for collecting so much wood. Because that would cost wood. It would cost exactly two things of wood. Yeah, the funny part is that I'm going to die a lot. Mm. And you guys are going to laugh a lot. I personally don't think I'd attempt the 404 challenge myself. It uh, just seems like it'd be uh, really frustrating. I'll be honest, I'm not really doing the 404 challenge. I'm doing Let's Play Explore 404. Let's Play Explore 404. Except I'm, I'm only taking a day to prepare because I'm going to be not an idiot. So this isn't really well, not really. So, besides, uh, besides, I mean, what way are you bending the rules? Let's say I'm gonna bring torches, and I'm going to go back into the cave once I die. Okay. Okay, I'm not bringing torches, but when I get the chance, I'm gonna make them. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Coming up on the time limits. I might have to go in about now. Our hero, ladies and gentlemen, boldly yet quite frankly retardedly, going in when he has, when he's nowhere near prepared. What's well, part of the 404 challenge? You're not going to be fully prepared. Yes, but I don't even have a full stack of wood. You may have been right. No, I can see that. One. See? Ooh. Ooh. And everything went to black. You mean went to lag? And I swear there's so much lag, and I mean I'm not even sure that our viewers will be able to watch this. Hmm. So how are you viewers at home doing? I can tell you that I'm great. Well, doing fine anyway. You know, you really don't have to go underground just yet. Well, the time limit says otherwise, so. Well, if anything, this will be fun to watch the ground just swallowing you up. There you go. Is it okay to say that I'm a little afraid to go down here? Yeah, it's pretty dark. Okay, I'm gonna go get some coal first. And that is the 404 challenge. Utter darkness. Yep, there's your light source. 
Oh, thank God. Did I ever tell you guys how much I hate lava? Well, now I fucking love it. Where's my crafting table? You will fill down good. Well, this is gonna be fun. Is everybody having fun? I don't know why you just don't go around. There are ways back up. If that water flow should take you back up. I know. Oh god. Hmm. You guys are probably laughing your asses off. Hmm. So, uh... What are you viewers at home doing right now? Where's the coal? All I'm asking for is a bit of yes. Oh, so <laughs> wow, that would have been unfortunate. I don't see why you're still mining. All the coal's just gonna fall down. Fall right there. All I have to say is sell fucking patient. Oh, oh what? The God, I'm gonna die down here. Well, you already said that, didn't you? Yes, but I didn't think it would happen so soon. I mean, we haven't even finished the first video yet. No, we have not. This may just be a one-parter. Oh, no, I'm coming back here if I die. Hmm. Wait, do no, I need the light? You realize it's like something so much just touches you right now, you're done. Yes. Which is why, if I'm gonna go down, I'm gonna go down with a laugh. No, you died. You guys better be laughing right now, otherwise I just wasted my time. Anyway, with that death, I will say thank you for watching. Let's play Minecraft 404. Sayonara, bye-bye.